All right, let's see what else happens here. Look at the expressions right there. It's discerning face. Let's see. Are your parents in show business? My dad is a DP. Yes, I, uh, he was the lighting director. <laughs> my dad. Director of photography. My dad. <laughs> mean to make it sound so, so no it's all right it's, i'm just no it's fine you help yes yeah thank you has he been on anything i would know uh there was a show called married with children Do you seen it seen show? it yeah absolutely yeah so uh... you know she's being honest here that is what her dad did he was a lighting director on married with children he won emmy awards so i don't know where the whole sizzler buffet growing up poor thing came from that's what's bizarre about her she doesn't keep the story consistent and one thing i'll say about megan you know she's dishonest she Seems like a narcissist. I don't think she's unintelligent. She seems pretty, uh, pretty clever. I mean, she really played Harry like a fiddle. I think she's definitely smarter than him. So I would think that she would think to keep her stories consistent. Maybe she just changed, you know, her whole story after being with Harry. I don't know. Uh, I grew up on the set of Married with Children every day after school for 10 years. I was there. Wow. I know. It's a very perverse place for a little girl who went to Catholic school, no less, to grow up. Because I'm there in my school uniform, right? Oh, yeah. Private Catholic school. And again, I will say, Craig Ferguson, I think, keeps things pretty, pretty entertaining. And then the guests... <laughs> it's a joke. It's a joke. Kind of a joke. Kind of a joke. Um, and then the guest stars would be like Tracy Lords, Tia Carrera, you know, these, yeah, the, um, those are some, some, yeah, uh, yeah. some women. So again, she had a big, huge step up into acting and now she really presents this like self-made poor sizzler eater. Um, you know, the sizzler buffet is the funniest, like they couldn't afford the sizzler buffet. I don't know if you've seen that. She did that in some uh, campaign. Yeah. Um, and so, yeah. They must have been interested in you walking around in your little schoolgirl outfit. Did they think you were working on the show, perhaps? Uh, thankfully, no. Uh, come on, I curly, curly hair and gap in my teeth. and. Yeah, did you see the rest of the people on that show? <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. Uh, yeah, I guess it could have worked. I mean, yeah. I, they watched me grow so up. So is your hair curly naturally, then? Is that what you're saying? It doesn't remember what it once was. But yes, I no, think I mean, once it's... upon a time it was curly. Yeah. Really? Yeah. I had very curly hair. Did you know? What does that mean? It doesn't remember what it once was. I don't know, it's kind of interesting with all the stuff she says. It sounds like she like hates curly hair, hates the idea of, I'm looking at my hair a little bit now, of her hair being curly. I bet it's I have to you. iron it to get it yeah, like that. Glad I iron it. Lots of product. You do mm, yeah, I like to put products in my hair. You do? You have great hair. Yeah, but products from the supermarket. <laughs> Such Actually, as? Actually, produce. That's what I like to my hair. Yeah, yeah, like I like to puree about, some broccoli. Yeah, broccoli and, and um, other vegetables for oh, fiber in your juice. hair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fiber. I'd just say he's pretty funny. I mean, he's talking ridiculous nonsense. It's really stupid, honestly, but he still makes it pretty entertaining. Yeah, I'd say with late night, Conan O'Brien and this guy were actually pretty good. There, let me know if there were other ones, but these in terms of like um, recently that I know of, like these other Jimmys are not so funny. I think that's a strong choice. Thanks. Yeah. Mm. We shall be best friends. I think so. <laughs> we'll have a little broccoli slumber party. Mm. Little <laughs> Megan's also my. Oh my gosh, that was. Wife's name. Oh. Is it really? Mm -hmm. Does she spell it with an H? No. Oh. Too poor as a child. <laughs> They can only get the five letters. We couldn't have, I'm afraid we can't afford the extra H. <laughs> you can either keep the child and lose the H or keep the H and lose the child. Whatever you prefer. Amazing. Yeah. They kept her and now you have the good fortune of having her. You, Megan No H. Uh, Megan No H, that's what I call. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that wasn't bad. I'll give her credit. I think that was okay. But he's amazing with his pants are an off-the-cuff humor like he he's making it entertaining <laughs> it's just a joke baby it's a joke oh no it's fine it's fine well let's call her meg and we're both in don't call her meg she didn't like that do you like getting called meg yeah i get called meg nutmeg also nutmeg <laughs> nutmeg that's i think i've seen some commenters say nut meg uh kind of threw herself under the bus a little bit <laughs> What was that? 
What was that shaking? I have no idea. But again, I think she comes off a little better in this one, but just some weirdness. Let's do an awkward pause and get you out of here. Okay. Uh. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> All right, that was interesting. I think he did a pretty good job of making her look uh, a lot more charming. And again, she seems to have changed over time.